Hi all. Uh, so I'm an educator at the university and recently I've been teaching my students about the connection between white liberalism and white supremacy and I'd like to offer just some working definitions here um, so that, that we've been coming up together with my students. What is white liberalism? White liberalism means valuing law and order and protocol above the lives of people. In this room we see white liberalism, and this is just from my students' reflections, um, embodied through the timer, uh, the please finish up, the numbers, the sign up process, the stage, and the barrier. All of these signs suggest that the law and the decorum and the civility of this conversation is actually more important than what is being said. Another aspect of white liberalism is policing people's tones of voice. The obsession with civility, refusing to hear black and brown people when they aren't following white cultural norms of communication. For young people speaking today to you, what they're saying is a matter of life and death. And I'm not sure what it means to you, but I imagine it's a combination between a sense of duty, being able to put a line on a resume, feeling like someone needs to take charge, and feeling like you're the best person for the job. Uh, and that's actually where the connection lands, between white liberalism and white supremacy. Because it's by maintaining law and order, and by maintaining civility, by keeping your front lawn nice and tidy, and by putting that all are welcome in our communities sign on your front lawn, you are denying the fact that all the while, you are, with the other hand, passing money to a deadly institution that polices with great disparity and causes tragic, tragic harm to the communities that are our neighbors and the communities that we actually should be building forward with. So, telling black and brown people to please wrap up suggests that their voices, their pain, and their stories are less important than the rules. And that, in and of itself, is the place where white liberalism turns into white supremacy. It's because white supremacy is the accumulation of these aggressive messages that say, stay off the grass, mow your lawn, act respectable, pull your pants up, right? So if I was to raise my voice and start using, God forbid, some swear words to you, I don't believe that it would be received in quite the same way as it would be if a black or a brown youth were using those swear words. So here's what I have to say. Fuck white liberalism and fuck white supremacy. Fuck it all. Thank you for your time.